Oh. Well, let me guess what I win. Am I going to win in Jag F type? I think so. Oh, would you look at that? Oh, I'm a freaking genius. I'm a genius, boys. Credits awarded. 100 grand. Do we go do some track toys? We go do the BAC mono. Let's go do a mono. Nick, make it blue and I will love you again. Okay, I'll go do a mod pack opening after this race. Also, I should probably go interior for this car. My heart is broken. It's not blue. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We'll go make it blue. We'll go make it blue after this race, and we'll uh, we'll open a pack as well. Does anyone actually have a full list of every mod that's in Forza 6? And, like, what they do? Because I'd love to know. Because there, there seem to be, like... I don't know. Whenever I open a mod pack, I get generally the same stuff every time. Oh my god, it's pitch black. Racing at night in this game is really cool. With those F1 cars, it's ridiculous. Because they, they don't have headlights, right? So it's just pitch black and just hope. I would honestly, if you're racing at night and you don't, you have a car with no headlights and you're racing like here, for instance, or like Spa, turn the racing line on, like the full thing, just so you can see where the track is. It's probably a probably a good tip. Yep. Yes, perfect, perfect. Oh, nailed it! Oh, what a cool pass. Oh, the cage would be so fast. Does anyone know if how to get a cage from here? Like to Canada. One of my friends did it. One of my friends' dads. He was like a crazy dude. He loved like really cool cars. He had like a GTR and then he bought a Catrum. I'm like, can you dot me please? And I have no idea how he did it because I don't think technically you can like, you, you can't really like buy them. So I, I guess they'd have to classify as a kit car. So maybe he built it. Hey, so who so far is pumped for the, uh, the drift tournament that's happening this weekend? The drift tournament is going to be so cool. Should be a lot of fun. We have some very cool commentators uh, doing some commentating for the for the whole drift tournament, and Alan and Cameron are going to be mod moderating the whole thing. And there are some sweet prizes. It should just be a lot of fun. I honestly cannot wait. I've wanted to do something like this for so long, and now that I can, I am so excited. I will be the unofficial judge of the tournament, telling everyone they suck. Hey, we actually took some really really good guy today. He um. Because I emailed one of the dudes today who, who's in the tournament. And I was like, hey, are you, uh, would you be interested? He's like, yes. Did not expect to get this email. But, um, yeah, he was really, really good. So, I think he, I think he, this guy could win the entire thing. Alan's winning. <laughs> I have a feeling Alan will not be winning the drift tournament. We will, uh, we'll have to see, though. Alan might put up a good fight. I, I, I think Alan's actually been practicing quite a bit. Alan and Alex are going to be the two... Uh, writers that are in the tournament. R is Raymond gonna repeat a win? I hope not. Also, I haven't practiced. Oh, well, Alan's gonna lose. Whoever's up against Alan, congratulations. Welcome to the next round. Nick, why do you always spin on your chair? Because I like doing stuff, okay? I always have to move. Nick, put your hair up. Yeah, well, if, if there's anything that needs to be done with my hair, Jess needs to be here to oversee how things go. Also, boys, extra life this year. Oh my god, it's gonna be great. We need to discuss how we're gonna do goals. Dyeing my hair is totally gonna be in there. I think. Yeah, the turbo. Whoa, someone's angry. Tom just got bullied by the beast. 13, it's not very nice. Make your hair blue. It, it's being thought about, but no, I'm gonna wait for extra life. If you guys can raise a certain amount of money, then uh, totally gonna do stuff like that. Hey, also, we're trying to get hoodies for the winter. We've had the same shirts for a while, but uh, I think we need to do a vote as for what, um, what, like, t or, like, sweater design you guys would want to see. Because, um, I went to look at samples the other week for, uh, for sweaters, and we got some really, really nice, nice sweaters. Oh, Tom, what are you doing, buddy? Smoking up? Blazing up? Apparently. Oh, Tom takes first! Oh, big crash! Nick takes first, suck it, boy! Oh, Tom is backwards. That guy's now dead. You know, it's BAC, though. I love it. Round the outside. Round the outside. Wait, wait what? What? All right, you gonna go around the outside? I'm gonna go up the inside. Bye-bye. <laughs> that worked brilliantly. Nick, you listen to Eminem? Yes, that is also a reference to Tom, though, when he sung that in one of our GTA videos, I think? I'm not sure. Tom sung that before, though. Hi, Nick. I love you. It's blue and looks good. Thank you. Hey, wheel spin. Okay, let's go for a car again, boys. How 
Do we win a car? Give it a minute. There we go. Now let's get a car, boys. Let's open up a mod pack. Which which uh, which mod pack should we open up? 300k? All right, everyone's asking for 300k. Let's do this. Let's see what we get. Is it going to be all the same stuff we've gotten? No, actually. What I get? Mod buff? What is that for? Collect 50 mods. Oh, cool. Earn... Th oh, I can do that. Well, that's new. That's... Whoa, that's really good. That's actually really, really good. Severe grip reduction. Grip re decreased by 9%. Whoa, plus 100% credits. Yo, that's gonna be so useful for the money grind. Oh my god. Okay. Um, okay, so let's uh, toss one of these guys on. Let's toss on... Sure. Open more. No, I don't have enough money to open all these mod packs. All right, exterior view. Final race. Sebring. I don't think I've actually raced on this track in the night. I've done uh, rain, but I have not done night. Says the guy with $10 million can't afford, can't afford a 300k mod pack opening. Shh. Don't look at my amount of money. <laughs> I was at 50 and I spent it all. And then I got it all back doing money methods. And then people want me to go spend it again. Yo, this is not how you be a good business person. Does anyone else totally remember in Forza... Was it Forza 4 that had the auction house? Was it Forza 3? I think both of them did. Anyways, in one of those games. Whichever one's the latest one that had um, the auction house. I would always buy and sell cars. I would... I would, I, I had a spreadsheet for their average prices of cars. And then if I ever saw one below that price, I would buy it. And then sell it for just a just a little bit above the average price. So I would like constantly be pushing the values of all these cars up. I would make so much money in that. Ah, oh, that was so good. I had like a spreadsheet of like every car and their value on the auction house. It was crazy. Nick doing pretend business in a video game that got dated in a year. Shh. I made a lot of money in that video game. This was before I started making videos. It was great. So it must be in Forza 3 that I put that up then. BAC Jelly Jelly Drift. Also, the last time we tried to do a jelly video, we just ended up trying to do a stupid wheelie in an F-150 Raptor. It was like, well, that's that's exactly what I planned on doing today. Oh, wait, we're going to do a Gurkha jelly build. We got you covered, buddy. Got you covered for your bouncy stuff. S-14 in Maple Valley. It's true. Maple Valley, most importantly. most Maple Valley and, and Fujimi. Also, I really liked... I think it was called Sunset Peninsula. The, uh, the really good track. Sunset Peninsula, right? It was like, it was sort of like a NASCAR track, but then there was also this really cool, like, interior part of the track. Had, like, some really, really good drift sections on it. I want that track, too. It was sort of, like, supposed to be a fake Daytona, I think, so I doubt they'll bring it back, but that track was also really fun. Now, I like my little light on the top of my, uh, on the top of my car. It's like a little, reminds me of, like, a little Spartan in Halo. It's like a little light just on his head. Okay, uh, I need to cash this guy or else uh, this race doesn't count. All right, there we go. Just bully him out the way. That's how you do it. That, that <laughs> took far less time than I was expecting. We still have a glitch where someone just bolts out ahead. Don't know why that hasn't been fixed yet. But anyways, third place will do. That's a, that's a good that's a good race. That's, that's fun with the BAC Mono. I like that car a lot. Also, am I gonna level up? Oh wait, didn't I have that thing on for drafting? Mm-hmm. <laughs>